What's up, you guys? My name is Mary, and with High Priestess Intuition, welcome my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, um, and you enjoy my content and my Gabby mouth, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings, just saying. This is True Sin for Sonic Cancer. This could resonate if you have cancer in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Node, and Hangar, Jupiter charts. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. This is Truth Hidden. It's a little different than my other series. It's a, uh, basically what someone in your life doesn't want you to know. It can be anybody, a friend, a neighbor, a co-worker, a partner, a past partner, Sally Joe down the street that has to be kissed. She doesn't know what to do. Anybody. Um, I got three channeled in, and as, uh, in as I was meditating on your energy. Um, the first one, I heard HIV. The second one, I heard trichomonas. It was about 30 seconds after HIV, trichomonas. Those are both STDs for anybody who doesn't know. And the third one, it was a couple minutes after I heard your child is about to win an award soon. So I'm assuming these are things, uh, if this res those resonate with you, it's met, um, things your people in your life doesn't want you to know. Now, HIV and trichomonas, I'm, okay, either I'm feeling either you are about to find out you have HIV or trichomonas or someone you're sexually connected to has HIV or trichomonas or someone you're about to be sexually connected with has HIV or trichomonas. HIV is a very, it's a STD, but it's a very, very, oh, it's a STD, a very, um, I mean, it's treatable, but it's a very dangerous one. Of course, they are all, all are dangerous, but, um, you know, a lot of them can be treated with medications and Things of that nature these days. Um, trichomonas, STD as well, um, can be treatable with medication. Um, but, uh, and then, so, and then your child's about to win an award soon. I heard your child, so if that resonates with you, your child is about to win an award soon. So, congratulations to whoever that's for. But the HIV and trichomonas, I would be careful. Maybe somebody is dating, maybe somebody's sleeping around, or maybe somebody's got somebody coming after them and they have HIV or trick. I hope, hopefully, God, you don't have HIV or trick, but somebody, maybe, um, of course, I'm not a doctor. I'm not telling you what to do, but um, I would just be careful. Um, of course, everybody has free will and you can do what you want, but just saying, just saying. All right, um, free general reading, so only take the messages that resonate with you, okay? Um, Thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. I just want to say that real quick. Thank you, guys. Um, my channel is back on the YouTube recommend recommendation list, and I think it's because of you guys. So I just want to say thanks, YouTube, and thanks, you guys, uh, for all the likes, subscribe, shares, unlikes, and donations to the channel. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 205. Links in the description box below. No cash out, no Venmo. Ten of Wands upright, seven of Wands upright. Someone you are connected with is about to find out they have HIV. It's going to shock you and cause you to stand up for someone you never thought you would stand up for. Oh my God. Okay. Well, maybe for some of you guys, it's somebody you're connected to that has HIV. Okay. HIV coming very strong in here. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. So... If this resonates with you, Cancer, I heard you're about to find out somebody you're connected to um, is about to find out they have HIV. Um, but when they find out they have HIV, it sounds like you're going to find out they have HIV or you're going to find out through, they're going to tell you or you're going to find out through the grapevine how that resonates. But it's somebody you're connected to, they're about to find out they have HIV. But I heard when you find out they have HIV, it's going to cause you to stand up for someone you never thought you would stand up for. Um, before um so you plug it in how it resonates sorry i got some on my finger so um you plug it in how it resonates so um it's some 
I guess it's going to surprise you when you find out that they have HIV, but maybe they were down talking or down trashing somebody in the past is what I'm thinking. And maybe they said they had HIV in the past or something like that. But somehow this person, you finding out this person that has HIV is going to cause you to stand up for somebody else is what I'm trying to say. So um, this is the person that has about to find out they have HIV. It's not you. It's somebody you're connected to. Ten of Wands, biggest burden in the throw. And this is you, your energy of standing up for the other person you never thought you would stand up for. But it's another person, not the person that has HIV. So that's just stand, you standing up for the other person energy. Seven of Wands upright. Spirit messages you have for Sonic Cancer. That's why this sound to me some of the, some of these situations might have been a, possibly been a case of slander. I'm serious, um, and it sounds like it, I, I think this person that uh, is about to find out they have HIV might have slandered somebody's name in the past and said that somebody else had HIV is what I'm thinking. But you're about to realize that the real truth, and it's the obviously the person that really does have HIV and the other person doesn't possibly. Um, that's what I'm thinking for some of these cases, but you plug it in how it resonates. If that resonates for you, HIV is not anything to be messing around with. It's really, really not. Yes, it's very treatable. It is very treatable these days, but it's definitely not anything to be messing around with. It can turn to AIDS in New York minute. Nine of cups reverse, two of cups reverse. Someone is very, very, very happy being single. Some single parent, some single. They were slandered in the past and said they were a drug addict and an alcoholic. But the truth is coming out now that they have been, ne been neither of them. Okay, wow. So you plug it in how it resonates. If that resonates for you, Cancer. Uh, a lot of gossip and slander energy in the past is what I'm feeling. Um, somebody's been around some kind of gossip train. Um, but a negative gossip train. Like, because gossip can be true, true or untrue. Whoever you've been around, if this resonates for you, um, or any of these messages resonate with you, I feel like somebody was purposely slandering somebody's name. But a lot of people, including you, are about to find out it's not true. Um, that's what I'm feeling, but you plug it in how it resonates. Um, so if this resonates with you, this is what somebody doesn't want you to know, that somebody is very happy being single. For some, they're single parents. For some, they're single as a Pringle energy. So like true singles, a Pringle, like no partner, period. Happy being very independent. No codependent issues. Um, um, and for some of these people, they were gossip and slandered on and said, and people were saying that they were, um, they were addicts in the past. Now, whether that was drug addicts or alcoholic or whatever, um, for some, I feel it's both drug addicts and alcoholics, but people were purposely slandering their name is what it uh, sounds like saying they were an alcoholic or drug addict for specific manipulative reasons. But I heard the truth is coming out that they're, they're neat. They need, they have been neither period. Um, and you're about to find this out, but this is what somebody doesn't want you to know, but you're about to find this out. It sounds like, so you plug this in, however it resonates, um, in your life. Um, the two of cups reversed is the happy being single as a Pringle or single parent energy. This is the, um, nine of cups upright is a parting hard to card. Um, so at addiction energy, drugs, alcohol, et cetera, et cetera. But I heard they have never been either. So they've never been an alcoholic or drug addict, but people were saying they were. Um, so that's why it's reversed. 
So, and the two of cups reversed is them happy being single. They're not in a relationship. They're not with anybody. They they are happy. They're not. Um, they're happy being single. So, they're not depressed being single. They're happy. Um, so no codependent issues basically. That's what somebody in your life doesn't want you to know. But whoever this is for, you're about to find this out for a lot of you guys, I feel. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Let's get one more. Spirit messages, do you have a song cancer? And the thing is, is people that lie like that, like saying people have HIV or some kind of STD or whatever, the truth is eventually going to come out anyways. It's eventually going to come out anyways. When you are around that person or you become around that person possibly, and you realize that they don't take medication for STDs or medication for to treat HIV or or it never turns into AIDS because they ne don't ever, never even had HIV, then duh, that would, um, that's a big indicator, just saying. Or if they don't take any medication at all. I mean, that's a huge indicator. Obviously, they don't have HIV. Um, or if somebody goes in their house and they're not seeing 10 Jack, Jim, or, um, Jack, Jim, or uh, Jose bottles up in the house. Or no Jack, Jim, or Jose bottles up in the house. Obviously, they're not an alcoholic. Or they don't see vodka minis in the trash can. Or there's no drugs in the home. I mean, or no drugs on the person. Or they've never been arrested for drugs or, or a DUI. I mean, there's ways to find these kind of things out is what I'm trying to say. Eventually, the truth comes out. Whether you are or you aren't. Spirit messages you have sonic answer. So why people gossip like that and slander people's names? I don't know why. Because eventually, well, I know why. They do it to uh, ruin their reputation. But the truth comes out is what I'm trying to say. The truth eventually comes out. So then it energetically boomerangs back on them because they're going to be known as a liar is what I'm saying. Nine of Swords reverse, Six of Swords reverse. A particular cancer is about to find letters. Some to their partner from a friend. Love letters. It's going to piss them off in a huge way. Oh my God, this is terrible. This is terrible. Oh my God. So you plug it in how it resonates. If this resonates with you, this is terrible. Cancer, if this re resonates with you. I hope it don't resonate with anybody, but I feel at least resonates with one person in the universe. <coughs> Excuse me. I heard one particular cancer. You have a partner. So it could be a girlfriend, boyfriend, fiance, or spouse. You plug it in how it resonates. For some, it could be the third party and situation sh ship crap I've been pulling in, but I don't feel it is. I feel it's a committed partner. Um, but you plug it in how it resonates. But I heard you're about to find um, letters to your partner from a friend. But they're love S type letters. Um, they're love S type letters to your partner from your so-called friend. So frenemy energy because they're truly not your friend uh, because they've been writing your partner love letters. Just saying. Heard it's going to piss you off in a huge way. And yeah, I'm sure it will because they're completely two-faced and they're obviously a liar. <laughs> and your partner is too. Um, that's terrible. 
So this is the line energy of the so-called friend, aka in front of me energy. And this is the love letter energy and you being pissed about the love letter energy. Um, yeah, that's terrible, man. That's terrible. Let me see if I hear anything else. A cancer's parent is about to buy a very large ticket item. And a cancer's partner is about to withdraw an extremely large amount of money out of a joint bank account. It's going to piss them off in a huge way. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates, if that resonates with you. Um, this is what somebody in your life doesn't want you to know. Apparently, uh, it sounds like one of your um, parent or parents is about to buy a large ticket item. So, a boat, a RV, a ATV, a um, home, whatever, some kind of large ticket item, motorcycle, whatever. Um, those are just examples. And then um, a... Um, Cancer, uh, cancer's partner is about to withdraw. I heard a very large amount of money out of a joint bank account. So um, I heard it's going to make you upset. And yeah, because uh, they didn't ask permission because it was a joint bank account, I would be upset too. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates, if that resonates with you. I love you guys so much. I hope everybody make wonder makes wonderful choices. If you think anyone else could benefit from these messages, please share these videos on your social media and word of mouth. I very much appreciate it. Love you guys. Namaste.